I'm Mark Bosmans. I work for Eurema. Eurema is the European Mineral Wool Insulation Association. We defend the interests of both the glass wool and the stone wool producers in Europe. Since a very long time, Eurema is a member of Construction Products Europe. We decided that long ago to be a member of Construction Products Europe, our umbrella association, because it gives us the opportunity to exchange views with other product manufacturer associations, both national associations and product-specific European associations. On some topics, it also gives us the opportunity to exchange our views and to come to a common position that we defend externally. For example, CPE has been very instrumental in all the discussions on the construction products regulation. Within CPE, I'm the convener of the task group sustainability assessment. That is one of the task groups which is under the sustainability working group. In that task group, we take time to have in-depth discussions on the sustainability methods, both at the product and at the building level. For CPE, it's quite important to have such a task group because we strongly believe in the sustainability assessment methods that are both product and building level. For all these assessments, we try to go into methods which take a holistic approach, a complete approach, so uh, what we call a life cycle approach, where we assess the impacts from cradle to grave, so over the full life cycle. These methods are part now since many years of a standardization process, which we call in more technical terms, the Technical Committee 350, so CENTC 350. The methods that we use there are all based on the fact that we want to have an assessment of the sustainability performance of the building. To be able to have that assessment at the building level, we are obliged or we are, it's better that we can provide information at the product level in order to be coordinated and to be consolidated at the building level. The information that we provide on the product level, which is based on life cycle assessment, is declared in what we call environmental product declarations or EPDs. We see over the last years that public authorities at the national level have picked up this approach of providing information in EPDs, while at the same moment on the European level we see initiatives like, for example, levels by the European Commission in the Part G environment, which is using this information to make the sustainability assessment at the building level. As Construction Products Europe, we are a very active stakeholder in all these discussions because we strongly believe that sustainability assessments at the building level should be based on information that we provide as manufacturers in our EPDs and at the same moment, we recognize that the current system is still not fully harmonized. And that is something where we want to put our efforts to come to a unique and harmonized system.